Right, I'm just about to open the American M9 gas mask and see what's in the can. I've just had to open the actual top of the can before the video because it's quite difficult to open. You have to open it with a key, like an old sort of tin. There's the lid and the key. And I had to finish it off with a pair of pliers. Okay, let's see what's inside. Hopefully you can get a good view there of the camera. This is of course the mask the um, Finnish M61 is based off on. Looks like there's some old comic strips on there, I don't know if you can see that on the camera. That's quite interesting. Because this is probably all from the 50s, this comic. Okay, everything else inside the tin is just this bag. So, let's open the bag. Oh, and it says on the bag, mask, protective, field, M9A1, face piece size, medium, position of canister stem, L, so I guess that's large, or left probably, so for right handed shooters. Okay, there's a haversack. US Field Protective Mask M9A Medium Large. Okay. How do we get this open? On the side right of it. Okay, here we go. So we've got the mask in here with some card on it to keep it straight and the filters in the back elastic straps oh, I'm going to get all this off, I don't know the card's quite cool though inside, it keeps it straight right, I think I'm going to have to undo the string here I should have probably got some scissors for this so I'll be right back right, I'll resume where I left off so we've got string on here to cut. Okay. It's one bit of string off. to cut the string again here. Or maybe not. Yeah, it looks like that's coming off now. Okay, now the inside of the mask is coming out. Okay, there we go, there's the mask. Here's the face piece thing, this might be really useful to keep actually to display masks on. So I'll take that out. It's got the filter strapped behind there. 252.5 grams, lot number CH11015, 8402, and it's dated 12.17.51. So it'll be the 17th of December, 1951. So, as tempting as it is to open this, this could indeed contain asbestos or other nasty chemicals, so I'm not going to touch that. Okay, let's have a look at the mask. That's the inside of the mask. That's the front. You see it's very similar to the Finnish M61. Just really the colours grey white rather than dark grey. And there's that lot number again on the side there. Okay, 
I think there was something else in the respirator in the sack as well, so we'll get that open. Yeah, there it is. Right, here we are. That is anti-dim cloth. This cloth is to be applied to the eyepieces after each type of mask has been worn. If the cloth becomes wet, allow it to dry without squeezing. Wet the fingertips and moisten the inner surface of the eyepieces. Rub vigorously with the cloth until the surface is clean and dry. So I guess this is like one of those Russian um, cloths. I suppose it's just to clean it, really. Yeah. Just... Uh, cleaning cloth so I'll put that back in because the mask's fine at the moment okay there we go and that's that sealed so yeah overall this is a pretty interesting mask and quite a nice set to get and there's the tin at the back there's the haversack there's the mask itself there's this interesting mask holder thing the cleaning cloth and the really old filter and all that cut up comic stuff that was in there as well I hope you enjoyed the video it's quite nice to be able to unbox an old mask like this thanks for watching